Hi, I'm Pastor John from Millerville Community Church, and this is Daily Devotions, number 45. Today's meditation is taken from the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 5, verse 6. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for for righteousness, for they will be filled. Our uh, Celebrate Recovery and our Road to Recovery is based on Matthew 5. And all of this is one of the foundational principles, which is those who thirst for hunger, for righteousness, they will be filled. It is normal for us to hunger, to desire more. I don't know. If you're satisfied with what you have or you're always unsatisfied, it's good to be grateful for what you have, but it's good to have the drive for more. But what we usually are driving for is more money, more food, more housing, more fame, more popularity. But if we would want more of God, we can keep coming to that banquet table again and again, and he will fill us. And we'll want more. The more you know God, the more you know his presence, the more you know his wisdom in your life, the more you know his power, his faith, his hope, his love, his his abiding grace. The more you know that, more you want of it. You want to live, eat, and breathe it all the time. We can never get enough of God. We can fill ourselves with... uh, busy activities of this world, distractions, we can eat and we can hang out with friends, but it'll never satisfy and do for us what God can do if we would eagerly desire him above all things. And this isn't about religion, this is about presence, the presence of God, a living relationship with him. I hope that's your desire and that you'll keep coming back for more every day because he has more to give we have yet to realize all that he wants to pour into our life our prayer this evening is father god i can't imagine why you love me so much but i'm glad you do thank you for providing food for my soul in jesus name amen let us continue to pray Lord, we thank you that uh, you called Jesus the bread of heaven and that we would not live by bread alone on this earth, but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of God. Oh, God, speak to us, talk to us, and help us when we read your word to hear you speaking to us personally. As believers, as followers, as recovering sinners, we want to be ever in your presence. Oh, God, Do not hide your face from us. Don't make it difficult, Lord, as we leave our denial behind and leave all our excuses and distractions away. Lord, what we desire is to know you and to know you more and to enjoy all the benefits of your presence. God, we've got a taste for your presence and for your glory, and we would have more of it in our life for it it is a life where else could we go you have the words of life lord abide with us again this day and every day as we seek your face we pray this in your holy name amen hope that's your prayer tonight and that you are seeking the lord with your whole heart i'm so glad you've joined us for our daily devotion and that you'll keep coming back leave a comment below and let us know how you're doing, maybe encourage someone else to make daily devotions a part of their regular routine as well. Until we get together next time, this has been Pastor John from Millerville Community Church, encouraging you as always to keep the faith and to share it too.